hello guys today i'm going to give you a quick demonstration on how to use shape kingdom and its new features this is blender add-on that allows you to generate all the 52 arcade blend shapes and additional facial expression for your rig character this add-on works with popular rigs in blender like auto rig pro and rigified it also works with your own custom rig character but for your own custom rig character please check this video link in the description it has video that go how you can do that here i have this character it is rigged with auto rig pro so i'm going to use auto rig pro for this demonstration but the same method applied to rectify rig so yeah let me go to post mode and test this character for you to see you can see this character has been perfectly rigged with auto rig pro so now this is what we are going to do after you store the add-on, the add-on will appear in animation tab here. So it starts from register face object animation to on scale expression and net shape key and this one's okay here. So I'm going to show you how you can use all this. First, select your character rig, which is the rig the character is using. You can see the name of this rig is called rig. So select the rig and just click on renew. If you click renew, you can see the character name is going to change to other shape keys. So this is going to be the new name and the target rig is going to choose that one as your target rig. Okay, so you don't need to select your target rig. And here we have the source rig. The source rig is which rig your character is rigged with. If it's a rig with auto rig, choose auto rig. If it's a rig with regify, which is the meta rig, choose this one. Okay, so this one we use auto rig. So let's leave it on auto rig. Okay, so the next thing we are going to do is we are going to register all your face objects into here. So the object we are going to register here is the one that's going to receive the shape keys. Okay, so here I'm going to add the body, the left eye the right eye teeth you need to add all the faces object it so add everything after you have did everything let's unhide them okay so now we have added our faces object into this collection the next step you are going to do is just click on transfer animation and hit okay so once you click on okay you can see there is there's animation keyframe that has been append into your character rig here so this is what you have so when you go to your timeline you can see there's a keyframe with 10 frames intervals and 10 frame 10 is eye blink left and you can see your character is blinking the left eye and when you go to frame 20 that is eye look down okay there is I look down left and it will reset on next frame and on frame 30 is I look down so so every marker represent a shape key and their name so this is what is going to convert into this shape key so here let me test the animation for you to see So here if you find out the expression is moving slightly you can increase or you can multiply the expression by here to increase how, how the eye blink or the jaw open you can multiply the whole expression by a value so here let's use this uh multiply scale expression so for auto rig you need to multiply only the location for rectify you can use rotation and location but for auto rig i'm going to multiply only the location so i'm going to multiply the expression so i'm going to increase the expression strength by uh, 2.5 okay i'm going to multiply it by 2.5 so let me go to here like the jaw open and to see example so i'm going to multiply by 2.5 okay and hit apply now you can see the jaw strength has been open more and you can see the eye blink has been closed more okay so here's the difference between before multiply the value and after multiply the value so after we are multiplying the value or you can also go to post mode and go to post mode and you can adjust some of the bones like this one the eye blink okay you can you can set it where so the eye will close as you want
so when you set the volume less than one it will decrease the strength here i'll choose current frame only that i'm going to apply it to the current frame only it won't affect the other frames okay and i use mirror that it will mirror to the left eye okay so let's go to frame 80 and now you can see it's mirrored to this side so that's what i want so i'm going to check the eye to make it blink where here so here insert key there is your open you can also decrease the strength as you want from here that decrease it and let's insert key after we have done all this we have our character having this So when you're happy with the blend shape or the expression here, we are going to convert this into shape key. When I select a character and I go to vertex, we don't have any shape key for this character, okay? So what we have to do is just go to generate shape key and I click on generate shape keys. And let's wait for it to generate shape key for all the objects that has been registered in register face object. Now the shape key has been fully been generated. Okay, so you can see all the shape key has been generated here for all the objects that's been registered here. Okay, you see all them have but this the names of the shape key is not using the arcade names. So all I have to do is just click on make arcade and I'm going to change all the names into arcade names. So the next step I'm going to do is just select your character rig and go here and click on clean rig. This will delete all the keyframes and the markers from the timeline and you have your clean character rig. So here I'm going to test the shape key that has been generated. Let's go here and test it. So we have eye blink. And now you can see the eyes blinking. We have jaw open and the jaw is open. Yeah, because of the teeth is separate we have to select it and set it to open here okay and you can see it's also follow so here i'm going to show you another add-on this add-on is so free link in the description it will take you to my camera to download this this add-on if it will help you to control all the uh all the object with just one object okay you see when you want to open the jaw you need to open it for this and also for also the lower teeth on the tank also this will take you time so all i have to do is to select the character body which is the bigger one or you need to select to control the added and add to the collection make sure i had in the zero or first on the list and press the select the address and play, click on plus to all of them and the next thing click on collect collect shape key names and then click on create drivers so after I click on create drivers, you can see the tank snap here. So now all of them is going to control the drivers. Now you can open the jaw and this one will open. And you can also make eye look down. And you see you have this. I have eye wide left. And I have jaw left like this. Mouth close. Uh, mouth funnel. Mouth back. Have. you also get another uh, after you generate we have this expression here let me check the check check proof eyebrows up and eyebrows see now all of them will be controlled you also have another expression called shock you get this shock expression wonder you also have alertness you also have this sadness you also have love you also have joy satisfaction this fear disgust you also have anger and this so on top of 52 arcade shapings you also get additional expression that you can use to animate your character as well okay so this is good so here i'm going to use